Hey guys, Rob here and welcome back to the channel. Well today is just going to be a short video but I'm going to show you how to order a custom model through uh, MR collection. So for those that subscribe to the channel you will have seen this model. This was uh, custom spec and made for me. Uh, this is my favourite spec of the Ferrari 458 Speciale uh, and it's exactly the same one as on my computer screen right in front. So uh, I'm going to show you step by step how to use the configurator on MR Collections website. So uh, all right let's get started. So uh, first thing you need to do is to, lo um, to go to www.mrcollections.com mrcollection.com uh, web address is up here I'll put a link in the description uh, to the website now this is the first screen that you uh, encounter on their website uh, it has all their upcoming models that are coming up uh, and if you scroll down uh, it has some of the featured models and some of the upcoming models as well. So uh, we're not worried about that. So just go back up to the top of the screen uh, and in the uh, top right hand corner, it says shop. Now just hover your uh, mouse over that uh, and you've got two options. It says Italia by MR Collection uh, right there or it says find a dealer. So we don't want the find the dealer. We want the Italia by MR Collection. So click on that. Uh, and that will bring up the next screen for MR. As you can see, really slow internet here in Australia. Uh, now, if you look up the top of the screen here, you have two options. So it says login or register. So if you haven't registered, uh, click on the register button here uh, and then excuse me, follow the prompts and put all your details in there. Now that is going to give you the most accurate pricing, whether you have to pay taxes or not, and also the, the correct shipping cost uh, for the models to be sent to you. So um, that is the best idea to see uh, the actual true cost of what the models are. Now I already have an account, so I'm just going to click login, press login there, once you register, this will be exactly the same steps. Uh, and now you can see up here, it says, Hi, Rob's Model Cars. Uh, so I am now logged in. So now what you want to do is go over to the red box here, which is Online Configurator, right here, and click on that. Now, once that uh, comes up, that brings you to the home page of Italia, uh, which is all the handmade models. Now this is the the screen where you can pick what model you want to custom order. So they've got quite a few at the moment. Lamborghini Huracan Evo Spider, Huracan Evo Coupe, SVJ Roadster, SVJ Coupe, uh, 488 Pista Spider and the Pista Coupe, uh, Huracan Performante Spider and the Performante Coupe, Aventador S Roadster, Ferrari 812 Superfast, uh, Lamborghini Aventador S Coupe, we've got the Laf Aperta, GTC4 Lusso, F12 TDF, uh, and we've got the LP uh, SV Roadster, uh, the LP SV Coupe, 488 GTB, and the 488 Spider, 458 Speciale Aperta, La Ferrari. Uh, and the model that I just ordered, which will be being removed, I suspect, shortly off this Italia service, is the Ferrari 458 Speciale. Now, as I showed you at the start, that is my 458 Speciale uh, model that was custom made. So uh, I'll use that as a reference for this ordering. Uh, so you can either pick in 118 scale or 143rd scale. Now we're going to go through the 118th scale configurator here. So let's click 118. And then that brings up all the options screen uh, for the particular model. So there is a picture of the car down the bottom. We'll get to that in a moment. Uh, and you can see all these little pictures here. Now all these little pictures uh, relate to the list of uh, options that you can choose. So 
Uh, let's start up the top. So it says body color. Uh, Rosso Corsa is the default color. So if you want to order it in that color, uh, the cost is zero. Uh, so there's no extra charge to get it in the default color of Rosso Corsa Red. Now, if you want it in another color, click the arrow and then this drop box will bring up all the other colors that are available. So there's quite a lot of colors available. Everything from Bianco Fuji to the end, Blue Mirabu, uh, Argento Nürburgring. I mean, there's a ton of colors there. So uh, let's just pick a uh, Azuro California, for example. Now, if you click on that, then that will adjust. So you can see over here, the color, uh, the color square has changed and the cost is shown here. So for that color Azuro California, the cost is actually 50 euro on top of the starting price of 395 euro. So, uh, and whatever color you pick shows up in this main window box down here. So uh, that shows you, uh, just ignore the wheel color and the caliper color and the interior color. This big picture at the bottom just basically shows uh, the interior color that you have selected up here. Okay, so uh, let's change that to uh, let's change that to a yellow. Uh, where are we? Oh, yellow moderna. So if we change that, it'll reset. It'll change up here to yellow in the box. Still 50 euro to have it painted in yellow. Uh, and you can see down here the main picture. It is in yellow. So this main picture down here is purely for body color. Uh, whatever you specify here in the options will not show up here. It won't have the color calipers or the color wheels that you dictate. This only just shows the body color, okay? Now, side mirrors. Uh, that's the next one here. Side mirrors, so uh, same body color default, uh, which most people would want. Um, so you can leave that as default if you like, or you can change that. So. Um, Let's change it just for example to Grigio Silverstone. And as you can see up here, uh, the color box has gone to gray uh, and that's a 10 euro option uh, to have the mirrors in gray. Now that's what this first picture is for here. So this shows a picture of a mirror. The first picture here relates to side mirrors. So that's what that one is there. Um, uh, probably should do, I'll pick another color because it's a bit hard because it looks black and white, uh, not wheel. Um, let's go Rosso Corsa, which would look really weird, but just for the example, uh, you can see there Rosso Corsa, it's a 10 euro option. And if you look at the first picture here, you can clearly see that they've got the color of the mirror is red. So that the pictures that follow across here relate to the list here. So let's go to the next one, which is uh, wheel style and color. Um, you can go Grigio Corso default, uh, which is no extra cost. But if we go down here and say, let's go shiny black, you look across here, uh, that's a 15 euro option to have the wheels painted in black. And if you look at the second picture along here, this shows your wheel, which is now in black. So as I said, all of these lists relate to the pictures across this way. Now calipers, we can go to calipers. That's what's going to be the next picture. We can go yellow there, 10 euro option. And this next picture along here shows the caliper color in behind the wheel. So that shows a yellow caliper that you've selected. The next picture along here is the next one here, which is interior color. So we can go, let's say standard crema or crema. That's 30 euro uh, option for the interior color. And then that relates to the next picture here, which shows uh, standard crema seats. Now that's just the seats. Next option down is seat belts. Uh, you've got a couple of colors to choose from there. Um, let's just go red for example's sake. You don't have to option everything. If you want to leave some of these features uh, in the default uh, and you're happy with those, you can do that as well. I'm just purely showing you all of these different options uh, for this configurator. 
So you can see seat belts, four point red, and you can see the picture here of the seat belts uh, in red. Next picture along shows the exhaust pipe. So that's special option one, pipes Grigio Corsa. Let's just leave that as they are, which is gray exhaust pipes. And that's what that picture is. Now they have a special option number two, which here, which is dashboard, steering wheel, and central tunnel. Uh, if you just want the, that's the next picture here. If you just want that um, just all black, you can have it black. But if you want to go into the options, uh, you can change it as well. So I picked the creamer seats, so I can pick the uh, creamer option in there as well, which is another 20 euro. Um, but you can see here in the picture that now all the dashboard, steering wheel, central tunnel is in creamer as well. Then you've got one more option here, which is um, carbon kit, special option three carbon kit. That shows this little fin here on the side sill. Now that one, you can have no carbon, front and rear under tray. There's quite a few different things. Um, let's just pick carbon kit exterior side skirt. Uh, and that's going to put this little side fin in carbon fiber in that picture there. Now. I actually optioned that one, so you can see on here um, that this is the little fin uh, that I optioned in carbon fiber. So um, as you can see, it's pretty simple. Every picture, uh, every picture that runs across here relates to the list running down. Now the special option four is no livery. Now if you want to uh, pick the NART, oh, let's go back to that one. Let's go to the NART livery. That's a 15 euro option, and that relates to the very last picture here. Now that's what I optioned as well. So I option, optioned the NART livery, which is uh, dark blue and white, which is underneath the clear coat, which is pretty cool. So as you can see there, excluding the body color at the top, which relates to the large picture, uh, and the very last option, which is the base, we'll get to that in a moment, all of these listed options that run down relate to the pictures that run along the bottom. So it's have a play around on it before you actually press buy. Uh, and you'll, you'll see it's pretty clear that they uh, are all in a line there. Now the last option here, special option five, is the base that you want the model on. So um, this is a little bit of a rip, I think, with the system that you have to pay for uh, the base um, because uh, you're already paying 395 euro for the model and then whatever options you put on top of there it really starts to add up so um, I think it's it's a bit of a ripoff that they charge you extra for the base uh, that the model comes on because when you buy these models for a lot cheaper just the standard ones they already come on a base with a clear cover in uh, nice packaging so I, I find that one a little bit unfair that you get charged for uh, the base but anyway there's quite a lot of different options on here um, this one here carbonian leather base with a standard nameplate uh, that's what I ordered here so this is the uh, carbon fiber looking base and a standard nameplate is this one here. So it just uh, says what the car is and then they put your name underneath it. So you can see here, Ferrari 458 Speciale and then it says Rob's model cars underneath. So this is what they call a standard nameplate. Um, now, I'm not sure because I've only ordered one of these models, but you can order it with a, uh, a standard nameplate plus a signature. So I'm not sure whether the signature goes on the uh, base of the model uh, or whether it's just a signature on the certificate of authenticity. I would assume it is just a signature on the certificate of authenticity, but I'm not sure with that. Okay, so uh, let's just go with a standard uh, leather ba base, or not a, no, let's get rid of that one. Um, Let's just go default wherever that one is. Oh, no default, black leather base, plus signature. Let's just go a black leather base. 
So you still get charged 35 euro for a black leather base, which I think is really unfair, but anyway, so um, that is basically how you use this, um, this list. Uh, as I said, all of these options here relate to the pictures that run across there. So you can work out uh, what you want to add and what you don't want to add. So uh, let's just, um, Let's just remove some of these options because it's super expensive. Uh, we're going to change that one. As I say, this is um, just playing around for uh, this particular demonstration. I would not order a model in this spec, uh, but you can see the total here comes to 565 euro. Now, if you're happy with your spec, uh, then there's a button right here next to the price which says buy. Now you can press buy on that and then that will confirm all your options on here. Um, 458 Speciality, there's all your colours there. They're all the options that you ticked um, and then you can press confirm. Once you click confirm um, I don't want to click add to cart because I don't want to buy it, um, but the price there is 565. Now I'm in Australia, so uh, I don't have to pay the 20% uh, VAT, uh, and then the cost of the shipping will come up in that list as well. So uh, shipping to me from Italy to Australia uh, is around 58 euro, I think, uh, from memory. So. Um, but that is basically how you order a custom model from MR Collection. Um, are they worth it? Well, this model was completely unavailable uh, and it wasn't available in this spec with the yellow calipers um, and I really wanted that one for the collection. So um, it's up to you. Uh, there's still quite a few models there to choose from in their, uh, in their range. So. Um, Definitely check it out. Uh, I am considering getting a Aventador S Roadster. Um, if I order that one, I'll take you through the process right up until payment. Um, but that, I guess, is enough to show you uh, how to use the MR Collection Models Configurator. So uh, I hope that was informative. Uh, I know I promised this uh, like a week or so ago. Uh, just crazy, busy with work, but uh, uh, hopefully that explains to you guys um, how to use this service. So uh, yeah, until the next video, thanks for watching Rob's Model Cars.